Good morning, Golf High. Today is Thursday, September 16th, 2021. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Mr. Rutherford, coming to you from WBUC Studios with your school news. The word of the day today is exonerate, which is a verb meaning to clear from a charge of wrongdoing or from blame. Can you use that in a sentence, Mr. Rutherford? I sure can, Elizabeth. The witnesses' testimonies were key in exonerating the defendant. For lunch today, we will be having PB&J, grilled chicken Caesar salad, hamburger, and cheeseburger. And remember, breakfast and lunch is free every day. And now for today's weather forecast. Rain, rain, go away. Well, it looks like that's not going to happen again today as we have a 70% chance of rain, mainly in the afternoon hours. It will be warm yet again with a high of 88 degrees and a feels-like temperature of 98 degrees. Stay dry and have a great day, Bucks. In 1620, the Mayflower departs England bound for the Americas. In 1810, the Mexican War of Independence begins. And in 1893, settlers race to claim land in Oklahoma. In current news, SpaceX launches four civilians to orbit in company's first ever tourism mission. Country music star Reba McIntyre rescued after stairs collapse in historic Oklahoma building. Study finds that skiers might be at lower risk for anxiety. And a 101-year-old woman continues to haul lobsters for a living with no plans to stop anytime soon. Here's the joke of the day. What do you call a fake noodle? Stay tuned to the end of the news for the answer.
Are you struggling with math? Tutoring is available for those that need help. Please see the math tutoring calendar on our school's website and attend as often as possible. We're here to help you. There is an Interact meeting on Wednesday, September 22nd in room 224. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Rice for more info. Today, there will be an introductory creative writing club meeting at 2 p.m. in room 256. For more information or if you have any questions, please see Ms. Wegner. Testing season is upon us. Please do your part by reading and heeding the signs on, on all doors about being quiet in the hallways where testing is occurring. If there is a testing sign on the door, please do not knock on the door. Respect those that are testing and help them do their best by being quiet in testing areas. So, what do you call a fake noodle? An impasta. That's all for our news. Have, Have a great, great National, National Play-Doh Play Day, Day Golf, Golf High. High. Welcome to September 16th on the National Day calendar. Fun is in the eye of the beholder. Take wallpaper cleaner, for example. When Joe McVicker first invented his clay, it was useful for picking up soot. But when furnishes changed from using coal to oil, wallpaper cleaner was no longer needed. That's when Joe saw a new life for his compound, and in the hands of some preschoolers, an idea took shape. The toy showed promise when he renamed it Play-Doh and added some color, but it took a certain captain to move it up the ranks. When Captain Kangaroo featured Play-Doh on his new CBS Kids show, the clay became a household name. Inducted into the Toy Hall of Fame in 1988, it's hard to imagine a world without this creative invention. On National Play-Doh Day, celebrate the spirit of fun that still fuels our kids' imagination. I'm Marlo Anderson with the National Day Calendar. See you again tomorrow as we celebrate every day.